boys welcome today we're gonna be checking out top 10 things which i like about carex number one is the steering wheel support this thing right over here boys steering wheel support at first was pretty horrible in carex not gonna lie but nowadays it's so good check it out abyss or jump clean in carex boom no problem by the way first attempt as well you can also play this game easily on a keyboard and controller as well you can also combine keyboard and mouse so basically use keyboard and you only use mouse for the steering but yes yeah, steering will support one hand boys one hand 360 no problem back in the day you couldn't do that i remember using my logitech g29 it was pretty horrible i can't even hear anything because of the noise the sound jesus so the developers are constantly working on the wheel support making it better making the car's physics better as well number two is accessibility what is accessibility goosiest i haven't learned this word yet listen you can play this game on any device look at that pc playstation xbox there is support for nintendo switch you can also also play Carex on mobile phones on Google Store. There's like two different Carex versions you can play as well. I wouldn't be surprised if they support microwaves in a week or two. If you're on PC and your buddies are playing on Xbox or PlayStation, you can all play together in one server. How crazy is that? Number three, the customizations. By the way, I made this livery myself. I made a Need for Speed Most Wanted livery in Carex myself. There is a livery system in the game. It's absolutely amazing. What I wanted to tell you about is the customizations the body kits front lines bumpers boots the scoops and everything side mirrors roll cages trunks rear bumpers spoilers tail lights exhaust you can change the seats in the game steering wheel you want a different one boom handbrake you want the big boy you got it shifter boom rims obviously there's like 10 different categories each category has like a bunch of rims here if you go into design we can paint the steering wheels the inside and the outside outside separately you can even change the color of your seats you want them purple you got it rims you can make the inside and outside different colors as well the suspension parts let's make the springs blue for example let's make these yellow maybe and the calipers obviously they have to be red the front and tail lights as well we can tint them look at that just a lot of customizations we can just change the fenders and like the roof like with one click that's crazy if you want red doors you got it all these parts we can paint them differently look at that a black engine bay front bumpers rear bumpers you can change these as well you want black hood boom number four the server list if you want to hang out with your buddies it is so easy boom random goose server you choose a map and the password is over here done and now you give that password to your friends and you're all playing together. It takes a couple of seconds to make a server in Carex. And you can get 16 boys in the server. Look at that, a clean 360 for you guys as well. I'm really enjoying the server support and the jump drift 360 as well. If I can do that, boom. Remember, in Forza Horizon 5, you gotta make a convoy, which is so horrible. <laughs> you get disconnected all the time. One of the biggest reasons I like Carex, the server support system this is so good if you like slow drifting you can put 90 adhesion over here and search for 90 adhesion servers number five is the mods so kina mod is definitely one of the mods you gotta have for example the lights boom also tail lights look at that you can have hazard lights as well in front and rear neons look at that we have yellow neons now we can disable the neons hazard lights on lights as well weather you can change how the game looks like with mods wow this is really bright <laughs> look at that like completely nighttime suddenly if you want daytime boom now it's daytime and this mod is not the only mod and look at that if you want to fly around like a crazy pigeon you can check it out i'm just flying so let's say we join a random server for now so there's a lot of players here right let's say that our car is too slow for the other players let's say everyone gaps us our car is very slow how can we improve that 
we would have to go back into the garage and make our tires bigger, wider. We don't need to do that with mods. Look at that. Press F4. If you reduce the tire pressure, for example, you put it here, your car is basically twice as fast. And look at that. This is how easy it is to like join online. There's like tandem going on there. There's two guys chilling next to me over here. Also, you can have like more exhaust backfire. Backfire is the flames. You can adjust how long the flames are enabled over here. And also license plate. Custom license plate. This is not in-game feature. And you can also use turn signals in the game with mods. And one crazy thing. Let's pick a car with not a lot of power. So for example, the MX-5. You can complete completely swap out the engine a 6 liter b8 2jz in a miata thanks to mods you can make it like a crazy dragster as well we can also change cars in the middle of the server you don't even have to leave the server we're not even halfway done with this mod and there's all sorts of mods for example let's go into training mode parking a and check it out boys another crazy mod i press one button and i am completely somewhere else Oh yeah, by the way, there are police cars as well with working lights. Check it out. Working police lights as well. But this is another mod. And suddenly we have traffic in Carex. In the base game, there is no traffic. We can be a police car avoiding cars. How crazy is that? Look at that, we're gonna squeeze in here. Boom, just a tap. Uh, help. <laughs> You can even ram the cars out of your way because why not you are the police good view as well very good for avoiding traffic you have a lot of control boom let's squeeze in over here might as well do a 360 in the middle of traffic boom that's how it's done and also you can share liveries between your friends so for example i didn't do this goose logo someone else made it for me and they shared me the library file i imported this into the game so the way you do this is with the kinema you go into visual you open the file and you have it pull the livery from your pc into the game that's crazy there's like an actual goose here. Number six, the constant updates. There is always an update going on here. For example, the latest update championship mode in Carrex. 32 players in Carrex can like do an in-game formula drift event. This is the feature over here. You can compete against other players with your tandem skills right here. For example, last update also added two new cars. We got a bunch of body kits, fixed bunch of stuff in the game. The game is many years old. It started as a mobile game it's now a pc game but they're still updating the pc game constantly it's nice to see that the developers actually working hard on the game i think this car was added like last year every couple of months we get like bunch of new body kits as well i remember this car has new body kits yeah this is one of the newest body kits for example that as well it can even have like a sylvia s13 with a 180 sx front so yeah always check out what's new if you want to check out what is the recent update in car x and they're also changing in the drifting physics back in the day it was so difficult to drift with the steering wheel but now it takes absolutely no effort the steering wheel support is like being constantly improved to hold the drift like that it was almost impossible the fact that i can do this with one hand anyone can do that with two hands let me throw a 360 with one hand as well just for the flex look at that boom <laughs> number six the events there's always a crazy event going on here as you can see there's a bunch of servers for example that is a streamer right there so basically go into twitch there's people doing formula drift events drag race events and you can join these events basically you go into the stream you get the password and you join the server easy as that number eight the reasonable price it's like 12 bucks on steam it's even cheaper when the game is on sale and there is constant sales on steam and you get a lot of game for that money i played this game over 1700 hours and every time i'm excited to play the game also very reasonable specs like you don't need like rtx 3069 mega card okay you can just play on your grandma's laptop number nine there is no competition there's almost no drifting games out there what do we have on pc for example assetto corza forza and maybe beam and g and like you can't have like 10 man tandem trains in beam and g i've never seen that before in carex the 10 man tandem train so easy to make basically three games besides carex that's pretty much it guys we need more drifting games and number 10 multiple maps in forza for example there is one 
huge map but in Carrex there are multiple maps and you might ask why is this good well let me tell you if you have one huge map it's very difficult to change that one huge map if you have multiple smaller maps you can easily add more maps you don't have to touch the previous ones you make a new one that's what they're doing and the maps are not even that small this is like a whole city over here this is just one map so this is why I like having like bunch of smaller maps. Let me guys know if you agree or not. Number 11. If you want to be a pro drifter in Carex, subscribe. It is scientifically proven. If you click the button, your skills will rise. And as always, boys, stay sideways.